Masters of Public Health program is a dire necessity in public health capacity building in, uh, in most of the developing countries, especially uh, low and middle income countries. So the Johns Hopkins University School of Public Health and IHMR both have decided to start a program in India. This will be a two-year program. Uh, one year will be didactic and the second year will be practical. This will be an uh, 80 credit program. As we all know that there is a limited uh, capacity and skill in public health and there's hardly any high quality public health program is available in this part of the world. So this program is basically designed for the students and professionals from India and Southeast Asia region and neighboring low middle and income countries. Uh, the unique thing about this program is that the degree will be offered by the Johns Hopkins University. And the registration and coursework, or, um, student assessment, all this will be done by the Johns Hopkins University. So this will be a very high standard program. Uh, the students will be mainly taught in Jaipur at IHMR, but the student will also be going for their orientation to the Baltimore campus of the Johns Hopkins University. The unique uh, uh, part of this program is that it combines uh, public health and management skills. So the basic uh, uh, gain in this is or the uniqueness in this is that it helps or it aims to build capacity not only in core public health skills but also managerial skills which is so much needed now to improve efficiency and effectiveness of health care as well as improving health outcomes uh, especially in the developing countries. Um, uh, so uh, we believe that this Masters of Public Health MPH program will be very, very useful. Another important thing about this program is that um, it's very low cost. It should be around 22000 to $25,000 uh, for the entire two-year program, and uh, which is much, much less than the program cost in uh, U.S. or anywhere else. And then the students will be, you know, uh, resident in India and the cost of, uh, you know, the residence in India is very low. It should be around, you know, $70 a month for uh, hostels and about $100 or $150 for food and other things. And the course material and books will be available here online as well as in the library. So the students are not required to buy their books. So it's a very special program. Now, important thing is who can seek admission or who are eligible to go into this program. It is a typical graduate. Uh, we look forward with two years experience in health and health related areas they are eligible for this. They are required to uh, have a GRE and TOSHA. And uh, the process is like this. There is a, um, a, a site of IHMR as well as Hopkins, uh, www.ihmr.org, or you can send email at nph at IIHMR.org. The process of admission will include uh, first you have to write on NPH at IHMR.org, then you will be sent a pre screened questionnaire to, to decide the eligibility whether you are eligible or not, and then once if you clear the pre screen, then you will submit online application which you will receive from the Johns Hopkins University and you will start completing and the documents that will be needed you will submit to the Johns Hopkins University um, 
there are a lot many documents that will be required and that have to be credentialed by a designated agency. That information is available on the website. After credentialing is done, then the, the joint admission committee will decide and finalize the admission. You will be informed about the admission process, um, uh, completion of the admission process and your status over in due course of time, maybe February or so. But the admission process will begin or rather has begun from September 15 itself and you can look at the admission schedule uh, on the website. Uh, now, in this particular course, how this is going to be useful? We are looking for, the world is now looking for uh, public health professionals who have the desired skills. Unfortunately, we don't have many. So, one of the major goal of this program is to, to prepare professionals with public health, core public health skills and management skills. And uh, there are plenty of opportunities uh, in all countries, everywhere in the world, to, to work. Uh, the jobs may be available with, with the, within the country as well as with the national and multinational organizations, NGOs and in the private sector. Special projects that are being uh, developed and funded by, say, Global Fund or the World Bank or the WHO or DFID, various organizations, or Bill Gates um, and Melinda Foundation. And there are so many special projects are going on, and uh, there is a very good placement opportunity uh, to get into these organizations after completing the course. So we strongly recommend uh, those who are interested in this should look at the website, write to us at mph at ihmr.org for uh, more information. Uh, the MPH coordinator, Dr. Jalpa Thakkar, will be responding to you and clarifying. We have also put FAQ on the website. If you have any questions, you can find answers on that FAQ. If you have any additional questions, please do not hesitate to contact us, uh, especially the MPH coordinator. Thank you. We look forward to have you with us in this journey uh, to build capacity in low and middle income, income countries in this part of the world. Thank you.